Peace. Wherever your wherever your head is at, your your body gonna follow. So that's why whenever you building, you need a proper foundation, or else you not building, you destroying. And if your foundation is trick knowledge, all you is doing is creating devilishment, which is gonna destroy you. You got to have a proper foundation, which is the thorough knowledge of yourself, which come in the shape, form, and fashion of supreme wisdom, or what's also known as one twenty. But if you're not dealing with that, and you're not staying focused on what your original foundation is, just like if you're building, and if you step off that foundation, you're going to destroy something because it's going to collapse. It's not supported. But dealing with today's supreme alphabet, which is number 18, R, rule of ruler, rules of standard, a standard regulation of law, set to govern a group of people in the kingdom rule. Ruler is the one who sets forth the law in order to govern the land in which his family exists, Right? You got two type of brothers. You got the rule type brother and you got the ruler. The rule type brother always looking for someone that always looking for somebody else's direction. Always looking for somebody else to give him instructions. When it's not something that, that somebody tells you, it's something that you tell the world. That's why you got to stop being worried and stop looking for approval from this world. You got to live of this world, but not be of this world. That's that's what Emir means. Emir means a brother who lives in the world who's not of the world. It means ruler, master, and king, or a militant ruler. It's a brother who's militant in his actions, or who's disciplined in his actions and militant in his conduct, or a brother who stays very focused, keeps his mind on what's proper, and he doesn't care about anybody else. He's the ruler of his own thinking. He's independent of this world. He don't care who who or what people feel about you doing righteousness. You know what's right and exact. Do what's best for yourself. Stop looking for approval. And if somebody don't care about it, it don't matter. Oh, brother, why ain't you eating meat? Oh, brother, oh, why ain't you smoking? Why are you doing this? Oh, you don't got time to chill? Nah, brother. You you dealing with the reality of what you need to do. You know what's right and exact. Stop looking for approval and stop hoping uh, for validation, right? If you know what's right, you trying to carry out righteousness to the best of your ability. Stop caring what other people think. Once you have knowledge yourself, you free, you God. But if you looking, a rule type brother always submitting, always laying down and begging. That's that's not God major, that's God minor. So you need to do what's best for yourself. And that's what Emir means. Emir means someone who's the master of his own and the master and the ruler of his own thinkings. He determines his own thinkings and he don't care or give a damn who the hell feel any way about it. You need to do that with yourself. That, and that's just an attribute of Allah. It's not that one special person. No, Emir, that's every righteous black man who got the knowledge of himself. Brother, who's militant in his, uh, disciplined in his actions, militant in his conduct, stays focused. So while you building, stay focused on the knowledge of yourself and the teachings from supreme wisdom, or what's also known as 120. Stop trying to add on all these different all these different ways, all these different things are trying to hide stuff because holy means undiluted, mix or tamper with in any form. So stop trying to soften and stop trying to add on to the truth. The truth stand on its own. And that goes for everybody, including myself. All right. So peace. And remember, stay focused while you building so you don't detour from your foundation and look, listen and observe. Pay attention to your own self.